In the ever-evolving landscape of digital currencies, blockchain analytics plays a pivotal role in bringing light to the shadows. It is the compass that guides legal professionals through the labyrinth of transactions, uncovering the truth hidden in the complexities of the digital ledger. Enter Chainalysis, a leading player in the blockchain analytics field. Its technology is precise, auditable, and transparent. But how does it work? It's quite a journey. Chainalysis attributes and clusters blockchain entities meticulously. It only ascribes a cryptocurrency address to a specific service or wallet when there is directly observable, empirical evidence. The same principle applies to clustering new addresses. This process is deterministic, meaning it yields the same outputs when given the same inputs, all based on a set of predefined rules. This deterministic clustering allows for the reconstruction of any given service cluster from scratch at any point in time. This auditability and transparency were put to the test in the Bitcoin fog case, where the defense alleged that Chainalysis operated as a black box algorithm. However, the evidence presented to the jury painted a different picture. Chainalysis methods were revealed to be transparent, tested, reviewed, and reliable. Beth Bisbee, a Chainalysis expert, detailed the process of attributing and clustering blockchain entities in her testimony, using her extensive experience in using Chainalysis Reactor in hundreds of cases as a DEA intelligence research specialist. The Bitcoin fog case was a landmark event as it led to the Daubert ruling. Judge Randolph Moss of the U.S. District Court for the District of Columbia ruled that Chainalysis's blockchain analytics is reliable and thus admissible as substantive evidence. The implications of the Bitcoin fog case and the Daubert ruling are far-reaching. It provides prosecutors with a valuable tool to prove guilt at trial. Moreover, it affirms the auditability and transparency of Chainalysis's blockchain analytics, which is crucial for the many agencies that rely on its solutions to investigate illicit activity. The Daubert ruling sets a precedent that will shape future cases. It is a testament to the power of blockchain analytics and its potential to bring accountability to the often opaque world of digital currencies. It's a victory not just for Chainalysis, but for every agency, investigator, and legal professional seeking truth in the vast sea of digital transactions. It's a beacon, a signal that in the complex landscape of blockchain, there is a way to find clarity amidst the chaos. So as we navigate the ever-shifting tides of the digital currency world, remember this. Blockchain analytics is more than just a tool. It's a testament to the pursuit of truth, justice, and transparency. And with each passing case, with each Daubert ruling, we get closer to a world where digital currencies are as accountable as they are innovative.